Magandang araw mga bata. Ako nga pala si Teacher Mariel. Ako ay natutuwa dahil nagkita tayong muli. Ngayong araw, ako ay magiging guru ninyo sa health. Ihanda ang tenga at ang mga mata dahil ngayon ay health time! So before we proceed to our discussion for today, V, can you lead the prayer? The Guardian Angel Prayer Angel of God, my guardian dear, to whom God's love commits me here, ever this day be at my side, to light and guard, to rule and guide. Amen. Good morning, Grade 1. Good morning, Ma'am Arabi. Good morning, classmates. So, Vien, is there any absent in your class today? I am happy to tell you that all of my classmates are present today. Wow! I am happy to know that all of you are present today. So last time I gave you an assignment, right? So did you list the food that you eat inside and outside your house? Aba, siyempre po! Very good! So leaders of each row, Kindly collect all the works of your classmate and pass it here in front. Okay, thank you leaders! Last meeting, we talked about the importance of exercise. Right, grade 1? So, who among you can tell me which of these four teachers are performing exercise? So, who wants to answer? Yes, Juni, would you like to say something? The fourth picture is running. It is exercise. Very good. Let's give Juni a five clap. So, how about you, Pong? The second picture, ma'am. They are doing jumping rope. They are moving their body, so it is exercise. Okay, very good, Kong. Let's also give him a five clap. Okay, great one. Um, Teacher Margiel is happy that all of you are present today. But I am also sad because most of you are still sleepy. So, can you all stand up? Because... We will go into sing and dance a song. Thanks for the meal! Yum, 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 eat it too! Yum, 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 healthy meal! Yum, 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 eat it too! Let's have a healthy meal! Yum, yum! Don't be picky, no, no! Let's have a healthy meal! Don't be whiny, no, no! Let's have a tasty meal! Broccoli, tomatoes! should not choose what we want to eat. All healthy foods should be eaten. Okay, very good. That's correct. We should eat healthy foods. How about don't be whiny? No, let's have a tasty meal. So what does it mean? Yes, Bea. We should not complain and we should eat healthy foods because they are tasty too. So very good, Bea. So everyone, let's give 
Carding and Bea, a five wonderful crap. Wonderful. So as a kid and an adult, we should always need to choose eating healthy foods. So now, do you eat any healthy foods, grade 1? Aba, siyempre po! So, Chino, can you give me an example of a healthy food? Banana. Okay, very good. How about you, Pat? Apple. Okay, that's correct. But, do you know what are the helpful and less helpful food that you are eating, grade 1? We will find it now because today is... on knowing what are the helpful and unhelpful food that you are eating or we are eating, teacher have a rule. So, when I say everybody won, all of you will sit properly. When I say everybody two, all of you will zip your mouth. And when I say everybody three, all of you will put your hands on your desk. Do you understand grade one? Aba, siyempre po! It's okay. Everybody one. Very good. Everybody three. Okay, very good. Let's proceed. When we say helpful food, so those are the foods that is healthy and good for our body. So, do you think an apple is healthy for our body? Yes! Very good. And what about the banana? Oh. Yes, ma'am! Very good. And when we say unhelpful food, those are the junk foods or the less healthy food that our body don't need. So that is harmful for our body. So... These are an examples of healthy foods. So the green part of the plate are the fruits and vegetables. So those are the low foods. So we need to eat a lot from this group. So Josh Pin, what can you see? I see tomatoes, carrots, and orange, mom. Very good. Yes, you need. Do you want to share something? I see apple and grapes. Those are my favorite foods. Very good, Denise. I am happy that you are eating fruits. So just like Eunice, we should all eat fruits often because it makes our body healthy. Very good. So now, let's proceed to the yellow part of the plate which contains of potatoes, pastas, breads, and rice. So they are the go food. So what can you see, Angel? I see pasta and bread. I eat bread every morning, ma'am. Very good. Let's give Angel a five clap. <laughs> These three parts of the plate are the grow food. So, what can you see? Yes, Kek. I see milk, cheese, and pork, and fish, ma'am. Very good. Those foods are the foods that are helpful to our body. So, do you understand, grade 1? Aba, siyempre po! Very good. Now, everybody want? Okay. So now, let us move on to the unhelpful food. So the first example of unhelpful food is the fast foods. Like the foods that you order on Jollibee and Hokdo are examples of fast food. The next one is the street foods and junk foods. Street foods like isaw, 
atay ay is an example of what? Yes, a street foods and junk foods like snacks, a one peso chip, candies, gums, and other sweets and sodas that you drink is an example of junk foods which is unhelpful food for our body. So why do we need to consider this as unhelpful food? So it is because it contains little protein, vitamins and minerals, high processed food, salty, saturated fat, and sugar that are not helpful for the development of our body. So here are some examples of unhelpful foods. Do you eat most of what you see on the following pictures? I hope you are not because here are some consequences if you eat a lot of unhealthful food. Number one is you will have lack of energy and fatigue because unhealthful food don't provide you with the essential nutrients. So number two is lack of concentration. When you take junk foods meals rich in oil, you will feel drowsy and fail to concentrate, which we don't want. Right, grade one? Number three is heart problems. So eating unhealthful food is a major cause of heart diseases. So number four is obesity. Obesity occurs when more fat, carbohydrates, processed foods, sugar, and less fiber are consumed. That's why I tell you earlier that eating the following foods on a plate which should also be eaten in balance. So number five is nutrient deficiency. So when you eat junk foods or unhealthful foods, you are taking away the chance to your body to be healthy. So because nutrient deficiency is happening when your body is locked on vitamins and healthy foods, you may have an anemia, osteoporosis, and vitamins deficiency. Just like what you see here. So, we should have a healthy eating habit to secure and to help our body be healthier. Because health is wealth, children. So, number one, always eat breakfast. So, why do we need to eat breakfast as always? It is because you will have more energy for the rest of the day if you eat breakfast. So, number two, replace junk food by eating fruits and vegetables as your snacks and desserts in every meal. So, dapat daw, kapag kumakain tayo ng snacks, instead of buying uh, street foods or a chip or a soda, we should replace it by eating fruits and vegetables. Number three, always carry a protein-rich snacks with you. This way, you'll avoid eating high-fat food on the run. Nuts, protein-based snacks bars, and hard fruit such apples are examples of protein-rich snacks. So number four, always carry a water bottle and drink at least Two bottles of water a day instead of juice and or soft drinks. Always remember grade 1, stay hydrated so drink more water. So number 5, always eat carbohydrates and protein together for more energy throughout the day. So what are the examples of carbohydrates and protein? Grade 1? Banana. Egg. Very good. 
So in these five pictures, which two foods belong to the fruit and vegetable group? Or how about this group? Which two foods belongs to the bread, rice, potatoes, and pasta group? Very good! Can anyone give me an example of unhelpful food? Burgers and chips. So, okay, correct. How about the consequences of eating a lot of unhelpful food? Yes, Karina. You will have low energy and be fat or obese. So, very good. Good job, everyone. Give yourselves a five clap. So, okay, it seems like you really understand and listen to our discussion for today, Grade 1. So now, I have here some videos related to our topic. You only need to raise the thumbs up if the video is showing healthy eating habit and a thumbs down if it is showing an unhelpful or unhealthy eating habit. So the first video, do you think it is a healthy eating habit or not? Very good. It is a unhealthy eating habit. So the number two video is... So okay. Do you think eating fruits and vegetables is healthy for our body or not? Very good. So it is a healthy eating habit. The third video is... So, okay. Do you think drinking water is healthy or not healthy for our body? Very good. It is healthy for our body. So the number four... So now, do you think that eating a lot of candies and cakes is an example of healthy or unhealthy eating habit? Very good! Seems like you are really understanding our lesson for today, Grade 1. So, now, I will group you into three. So, each group will be given a 5 minutes to draw their favorite healthy foods and explain why those are their favorite foods. Time's up, Grade 1. So, now, Group 1, can you proceed here in front and present your work? Wow! The work is so wonderful. So let us give the group one a five wonderful clap. One, two, three, four, five. Wonderful. So how about the group two? Very good. Group two also have a wonderful and beautiful drawings. So let's also give them a five wonderful clap. Wonderful! So the last group, group 3. Very good! Group 3 also have a beautiful work. So let's also give them a 5 wonderful clap. Wonderful! Since all of you understand our lesson for today, I will be giving you a 5 item so for the direction, write T if the statement is true and F if the statement is false. So number one, eating fruits and vegetables is bad for your body. Number two, soda and candies are examples of unhealthy food. Number three, we should eat breakfast every day. Number four, 
Obesity is cause of eating too much healthy food. Last number, go, grow, and glow foods are helpful food for our body. So for your assignment, cut pictures of different foods and label them if they are helpful and unhelpful food and paste picture on a 1-8 illustration board. So that's all for today. Be good, be kind, and stay safe everyone. Goodbye, great one!